Welcome. Today's topic will cover how to create a transfer document in DD1354. We will cover the following topics. Navigating through the DD1354 module and how to create a transfer form DD1354. The transfer document can be prepared for the transfer and acceptance of DOD real property with the using agency by creating the DD1350 form. This form can only be created in government mode and relies on the real property items that have been set in the real property module. To create a DD1354 transfer form, enter into the contract. On the contract menu, click on the tab that says Close Out and enter into the module by clicking on the blue tile that says Transfers DD1354. This will open the transfer selection view. Here you can add, edit, and delete DD1354 transfers. To add a transfer, click on the Add button icon. Upon adding or editing transfers, you'll be presented with the current view, the transfer edit view. The transfer form is broken down into three different sections. These sections are divided into these three tabs. The first tab is the header slash real property tab, the deficiencies, and the remarks. To view the transfer form at any time, click on the button at the top that says DD form 1354. Here we can see our transfer form. Our transfer form is generated from the data from the transfer edit view that you input. Sections 1 through 8 is generated from the transfer view under the header tab, which would be this first section up here. This top portion generates sections 1 through 8. The section below that generates sections 24 through 26 on the transfer form, which would be the section down here at the bottom. Sections 9 through 23 are generated when adding a real property item. We will now demonstrate what the form looks like and how to add a real property item to a transfer form. To add a real property item, click the Add button. Here you'll see a lookup of the real property items that have been added to the contract. You can add more real property items to the contract by going to the Real Properties module under the Closeout tab. To add a real property item, select the real property item that you want to add and click OK. Now if we generate the report, we can see our real property item has been generated and it generates the fields sections 9 through 23. Now if we scroll down to the next page of our transfer form we can see section 27. Section 27 contains our construction deficiencies. We can add construction deficiencies by going back to the transfer edit view and clicking on the deficiencies tab. To add a construction deficiency click the add button. Here you'll see a lookup of deficiencies that have been added to the contract through the QA report. Select the deficiency that you would like to add and click OK. Now we can preview our report to see our construction deficiency show up in section 27. We can now move on to section 28 which is the project remarks. This will be the last tab that is labeled has remarks. This tab includes the project description along with the project costs. This will need to be filled out to fill out the final section on the transfer form which is section 28. After you filled out the information on all three tabs for your transfer form, you can save the form and add it to the document package down below. Now, in summary, we have gone through how to navigate through the DD1354 module and how the transfer edit view maps to the transfer form.